Alrighty, I have an in-park construction update for you guys today. So as you can see, the trees around Shockwave have all been removed. Um, so they've removed all the trees. They've come in and put all this sod down. Um, obviously, that has to do a lot with the work that's about to happen. But also, those trees were getting just decimated um, and left looking disarray. Um, after, you know, like when trees get too close to a ride, a park has to get rid of them or cut them down. So I think the park just went and made the executive decision to completely remove the trees. Um, so on this whole subject of tree gate at Canada's Wonderland, there seems to be an all out war, um, of the park versus trees. So, but yeah, anyways, back on topic over at Elfin Fury, we have our Winterfest slash Halloween haunt stage. Um, and as you can see there, there's the rebar cages that are ready to go for Elp and Fury. Um, so I'm kind of excited for that. Over at the mountain, um, in yesterday's video, you heard me talking about these little orange dots kind of signifying where support columns would have to come down into. Uh, it's a lot of near misses if you're looking closely, especially like in correlation to the washroom entrance and exit and Guardian's little entrance there. Um, so really curious to see how this is gonna look at the end of the day with the back end of the mountain just being a total um, ruckus of steel and supports. So, but again, I'm really excited about Elpen Fury, so that's okay. Inside the mountain, nothing too, too exciting going on. Not a lot of work that is very evident. Um, there is some electrical wiring that they've run across the top there, as you can see the conduit. Um, and definitely some work in, in terms of restructuring the top. But nothing that's like apparent. I will say when I was standing there, it's normally really hot in there. But when I was standing filming there yesterday, it was a rush of cold air just shooting out of the mountain. And it had a large chlorine smell to it. And if you looked at the falls, the falls were not on full power. So I don't know if they've been working on something or they've opened up a big wall in there. But I could definitely feel the rush of wind and cold air and the smell of chlorine just standing there. So that was quite interesting. Um, nothing exciting going on in Elpen Fury Spot of Land other than the fence is getting pushed back a lot so you can get a lot closer to the construction site. Um, but yeah, again, that, that's, that's all for now. I don't think I have anything else to report on. Obviously, there's some Halloween haunt stuff, so stay tuned for another video on Halloween haunt prep. I'll put a little teaser here. There's some cool new clown masks up in the clown scare zone. Um, so, yeah, really excited for Haunt, truthfully. Um, and, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed today's little uh, non-eventful in-park update. Have a good one, guys. <laughs> Bye.